This video has been suggested from this comment. So remember to like and comment on my videos so that your song suggestion may become the next piano lesson. Also, only about 10% of you who watch my lessons are subscribed, so if you enjoyed or learned something from this video, please consider subscribing. It's free, and you can always undo it later. Anyway, let's get right into the lesson. Hello guys, this is Amos on Music, and in today's lesson, I'm going to teach you how to play Just Be by DJ Khaled. There are a few sections you're going to learn today's lesson. The main uh, instrumental section that plays throughout the song that you can play and sing and rap, and then I'll be teaching you the pre-chorus and the chorus section. I'll give you a preview before we start each section. So the first section, the very iconic instrumental goes like this, check it out. Etc. It's like a loop like that. Anyway, let's learn this first section first. So there's three sections. This is the first one. So right hand goes E, F sharp, G sharp, A, G sharp, E, F sharp, and then we go up to the high, um, F sharp, D sharp, B, down to F sharp. Okay, so that's the first part. Okay, the last bit is like, it's kind of like a fast downward arpeggio. It's like a se second inversion of B major arpeggio from the F sharp. All right, so we have, let's learn it again. E, F sharp, G sharp, A, G sharp, E, F sharp, and up to the high downward arpeggio of the B major second inversion, like that, okay? Left hand, we have two chords with E major, which is E, G sharp, B, and then first inversion, B major, which is D sharp, F sharp, B. With these two chords in mind, two hands together goes like this, so E and E major together, F sharp and chord together, and then the arpeggio downwards, like that. Let's learn it again, so together, Moving on to the second part, Ryan continues, D sharp, E, E, D sharp, down to B, down to F sharp. That's it for the right hand, let's learn it once again. So it goes D sharp, E, E, D sharp, down to B, down to F sharp. That's it. A bit more simple for the second part. Left hand, we have two chords, C sharp minor, C sharp, E, G sharp, and second chord, G sharp minor, which is G sharp, B, D sharp. With these two chords in mind, so C sharp minor and G sharp minor, the two hands together goes like this. The so right hand starts, E and chord to get on. D sharp and chord to get on. Ryan continues. Like that. Let's learn it once again. So it goes, to get on. To get on. That's it. Okay, back to back. The two parts we've learned in this lesson will be played like this. Oops, too high. Goes like this. And you just repeat it. This is the instrumental, so you can play it this and rap and sing to it. Etc. Okay, so that's it. Okay, now moving on. You know, we're gonna learn the pre-chorus, give you a preview before we start. It goes like this. Let's go ahead and learn it right now. So break it up to parts. So right hand goes F sharp, F sharp, F sharp, F sharp, E, C sharp, F sharp, E, F sharp. That's it for the first part. Break it up to four parts, okay? So F sharp, F sharp, F sharp, F sharp, E, C sharp, F sharp, E, F sharp. That's it for the right hand. Left hand, we have the two chords, E major and first inversion D major. That's, you know, from the four chord series because every single uh, Part and less in this lesson is the same four chord pattern. So the E major, first inversion, B major, C sharp minor, and G sharp minor. Okay? So yeah, with those two chords in mind, so right hand starts after the F sharp's E major by itself, right hand continues. After F sharp chord by itself. That's it. Let's learn it again. It goes here. Here. Moving on to the second part, Ryan continues, goes B C sharp F sharp F sharp G sharp E C sharp F sharp E F sharp. That's it for the second part for the right hand. Let's learn it again. It goes B, C sharp, F sharp, F sharp, G sharp, E, C sharp, F sharp, E, F sharp. That's it for the right hand. Left hand, two chords are C sharp minor, which is 
C sharp, E, G sharp, and G sharp minor, which is G sharp, B, D sharp. So with those two chords in mind, two ends together goes like this, so right hand starts. After G sharp chord by itself, right hand continues. After F sharp, G sharp minor by itself. That's it. Let's learn it once again. So it goes here, here. That's it. Okay, now moving on to the third part, right hand continues, goes E, F sharp, two G sharps, and then up to B, down to E, F sharp, F sharp, E, F sharp, F sharp. Okay, let's learn this third part again, it goes E, F sharp, G sharp, G sharp, B, E, F sharp, F sharp, E, F sharp, F sharp. That's it for the right hand. Left hand, two chords of E major, which is E, G sharp, B, and first inversion B major, which is D sharp, F sharp, B. With these two chords in mind, two hands together goes like this, so right hand starts. Up the two G sharps, E major by itself, Ryan continues. Next F sharp and chord together. That's it. Let's learn it once again. So it goes here. Together. Alright. Moving on to the fourth and last part here. Right hand continues. Uh, it's similar to the first part, uh, right hand. So F sharp, F sharp, F sharp, F sharp, E, C sharp, F sharp, E, but then change to G sharp. Like that. Let's learn it again because F sharp, F sharp, F sharp, F sharp, E, C sharp, F sharp, E, G sharp. Left hand, two chords this time is the second um, set of two chords, which is C sharp minor, which is C sharp, E, G sharp, and G sharp minor, G sharp, E, D sharp, that you know already from the sequence. Two hands together goes like this, the right hand starts here, here. So same placement of chords compared to the first part, okay, just with the different notes and chords. Here. Here. And that's it for this second section, the pre-chorus section. So it goes like this. Yeah, moving on to the third a section which is the chorus section, the just be just be part, Let's give you a preview, it goes like this. There you go. Okay, let's go ahead and learn it. So, first part goes like this. G sharp, F sharp, G sharp, E. And to down to G sharp, F sharp. And then B, B, G sharp, F sharp, E. G sharp, D sharp. Okay. Let's learn this again. So it goes G sharp, F sharp, G sharp, E. Down to lower G sharp, F sharp. B, B, G sharp, F sharp, E. G sharp, and to D sharp. All right, left hand is the four chord series, which is the E major, first inversion, B major, C sharp minor, and G sharp minor that you know from already the first section and the second section. Two parts back to uh, the two hands, I mean, right hand and left hand, we play like this. So right hand starts, E and E major together, G sharp and chord together, right hand continues, G sharp and C sharp minor together, and then D sharp and G sharp minor together, like that. Let's learn it once again, so it goes like this, together, Together. 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 Like that. Alright. So that's the first part. Moving on to the second part, right continues, because B B G sharp F sharp G sharp E F sharp and then B B G sharp F sharp E G sharp down to D sharp. Like that. Okay, and let's learn it once again. because B B G sharp F sharp E Wait, wait, let's do it again. So it goes B, B, G sharp, F sharp, G sharp, E, and then F sharp, and then B, B, G sharp, F sharp, E, G sharp, D sharp. Yeah, like that, okay? One more time to confirm it. So B, B, G sharp, F sharp, G sharp, E, for the first half in there, and then F sharp, and then up to B, B, G sharp, F sharp, E, G sharp, and then down to D sharp, like that for the right hand. Left hand is the same four chord sequence that you know very well now. Two hands together goes like this, so right hand starts. E and E major together on. F sharp and chord together on. Ryan continues. G sharp and C sharp minor together. And then D sharp and G sharp minor together. Like that. There you go. Alright, so let's learn it again. Together on. Together on. Together on. Together on. 
and that's it so back to back the two parts of this uh, chorus third section goes like this And there you go and that's pretty much it so you can just play around and improvise as i said you can actually just learn the first section and play that throughout the whole song because that's actually what's behind the whole instrumental so you can just go with that and sing and rap over it okay so yeah that's pretty much it if you like how i teach in this video how i break everything up step by step part by part you will most likely find another song that you'd like to learn by typing in your favorite song name followed by Amos Doll in the search bar because I have over 10,000 piano videos on YouTube. If you want to go further beyond into learning music theory, playing by ear and improvisation, you can learn from my piano courses on my website bestpianomethod.com linked in my description and bio. There, you will also find my song request services where you can request any song of your choice for me to make into a cover, a lesson, or sheet music. As for now, enjoy the rest of my content on YouTube, TikTok, Instagram, and Facebook, and see you all next time.